whale songs? Maybe this is the only soothing thing Nathan ever hears. Whale songs? That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Right. That looks like a totally fun show. Even Nathan has a light side. Yes, I would be cool with having this high-tech projector. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. If only all your energy went into photography. It's so damn creepy, but... The guy has his own style. Okay, his photographs are kind of okay. Diploma? That's so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. Wow, the best son in the world. This diploma certifies that Nathan Prescott is officially the best son in the world. Amazing. Uh, Alright, this guy, what is this? I don't think one book can guide the Prescotts. Rage On, a teen parent guide to anger management, Dr. Bill. Camera, lens. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescotts rule. That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. Bastard. No, it's why bastard? It's not the money that makes him a douchebag. His douchebaggery makes him a douchebag. Stop hating people for their money. Is that? Come on, Max. You're in the belly of the beast. Search everywhere. That's abstract expressionism. Is that the cabinet of Dr. Gallagher? Of Dr. Caligari? Is that what this is? I think it is. It is. Is it? I think it is. Wait a minute. Is it? I think it is. Okay, let's just continue. I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. Well, not even when you drink it with wine. Uh, this computer, this menu, what is this? Nathan Prescott. All American teen. Is the, is the magazine called Butts and Boobs? <laughs> Hold on. Read, butts and boobs, Oregon's best boobs, crystal, brand new shoot. Well, butts and boobs, pretty much. I guess that's uh, what you want. Oh man, that dickhead stole one of my selfies. Take it back. Take it back from him. Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. These films all have a dark pattern. Holy shit, that's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... A gift from whom? Uh, instructions for use, important safeguards, GB17, 9mm pistol owned in the manual. Alright. Uh, photo. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Huh. Okay, so we need to use the computer. Nathan is way into this party. Bad sign. He's gonna rape someone there, of course he's into it. Um, what's up to Victoria Chase? Hey gorgeous, let me know what you're wearing to the Vortex this week so I can wear something just as styling and expensive. I'm psyched about going and I'm picking up some serious party favors. I even told my dad to keep the pigs away from Blackwell so we can get wrecked without hassle. If we're going to have an end of the world theme, then let's do it fucking on point, right? Oh, bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. And why Kate will get justice. Vortex Club, October 2013, Party Hard, Kate's Gone Wild. You roll. You could... You can probably, like, get the site to take down the video. Oh, man. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. 
Nate, I know this has been a stressful week and your mother and I are here to talk if need be. <laughs> if need be. Just make an appointment anytime. <laughs> Have your son make an appointment with you. Amazing. Just make an appointment anytime. Your mother wants Dr. Bill to come out after his book tour, but for now, let's stick to your prescriptions. I need you to come and quiet while Pan Estates is being developed. I know being a Prescott is a burden, and I'll guide you into this room step by step, as did my father. It was hard for me when my dad opened my eyes to our destiny, but you'll thank me someday. Don't worry about Blackwell. This shit hotel is going to get an enema along with the fresh brand. I want you to be ready to take over when the moment is right. Don't fuck it up, son. Your father. Interesting. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. And far away. Christine? To do... Be... To do burn from Brazil. Little brother, it's been too long since I've heard from you, so please let me know what's going on in your exciting scholastic life at Blackwell. I, bla I bragged to all my co-workers in the Peace Corps that my talented bro Nate got a full scholarship to one of the best art schools in the world. Even though I can't always check my mail or phone, please, please, please send me some new photos of campus so I can live vicariously through your lens. I miss you and your pictures. And yes, mother told me you've been in trouble and father has been on your ass, but you have to either ignore him or stand up to him. You know I love dad, Nate, but I'm also in a jungle halfway across the world because of him. He's a bully who inherited power, not wisdom, and the only way to win against one is to fight back. Don't let him change you into one just for the family legacy. End of lecture, you're at school. So I just wanted to make you feel at home. Back to the mangrove, sending out good thoughts. Better write back or have a Jaguar shipped to your dorm, Chris. Um, is the game trying to make us feel sorry for Nate? Or for... for um, yeah, him? Because... None of this justifies what he's doing to people. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Extreme diet suppressants available online without prescription. All right, well, maybe he does. Wow. Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. Nathan, I'd like to apologize for the recent accusation. Your name and record speaks for itself. Sometimes students will use that to make their own name at Blackwell. I know your father was upset while I have assured him that you would never bring a weapon to school. I don't want you distracted from school and I'm certain this matter will be settled by the end of the week. If you have any questions, you know I'm always available to talk. I... Wait a minute, I haven't found anything. Please, please, please stay away, Nathan. I've looked at everything and I haven't found anything. What am I looking for? Nathan is way into the... To wow. Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. Uh, wait a minute, scratch marks? What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Move the, move the chair. Move the chair. Move the couch. Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. There's a phone in the now bag. I have Nathan's phone so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. There's a phone in a bag behind the couch? What? Alright, so I think we've looked at everything there is to look at. Cool, now it's open. Okay. It's kind of odd, but okay. Hi, Chloe. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. 
doing in my dorm? It's not your dorm, bro. You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Do you really? Get the fuck out of my face. <clears throat> oh, nice. Good job. You are so fucking dead. <clears throat> nice. Shoot him. Get off me, bro. <clears throat> <clears throat> Um, stay out of it, stop Warren. Stay out of it, stop Warren. Stay out of it, stop Warren. Let me... Someone get the gun, and we'll stop Warren. Warren, stop it! Come on! Oh! Oh, my head! Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? Get the gun! You! And you! You're all dead! Let's go! Now! Plus, my dad is on his way! You're all fucked! He owns you! Why would you let him have the gun? Even if Nathan definitely deserved a beating, we should try to be better than that. Well, I mean, actually, I was kind of thinking we'd get the gun and shoot him in the head, but okay. Why would you let him have his gun back? That's like the most ridiculous thing ever. That was intense. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For headbutting Nathan Prescott. That was awesome. I don't know. I almost went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better, um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Don't. Yes, you are. No, don't. No, don't be alpha. Don't be alpha. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. What do we get out like of Nathan's said, phone? Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. What do we get out of Nathan's phone? That was that was ridiculous. Come on. Why would you God. let him have his gun? I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Yes. Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grow up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just talk to Frank so we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. You don't actually have money for him though? How's this gonna work? We need a code for the book. Okay, 
and now we're here. Let's look around, shall we? I don't want to go that way. Shh, but I do. I want to go that way, Max. Who's in charge here, you or me? Nope, I don't want to go there. I want to go there. Alright, well, apparently she's in charge. Signpost. The forest seemed quiet. No sign of life. Or deer. Hmm. Well, I mean, the fight, look, the rationale is that once you, once you've disarmed the guy, you don't need to beat him up anymore, right? Either you take the gun and kill him, or you take the gun and don't kill him. Frank doesn't need tinted windows when they're this dirty. Uh, sign, no parking on the beach. Now get the sign. No worries, sign. Right. Why is that even clickable? I may not know quantum speak, but there has to be an explanation. There has to be a smell, is what you mean. Dead whales. This is where my nightmare started. Hiking trail to the lighthouse. Okay. What other shenanigans can we get up to? Ah, uh, there's nothing here. This thing will. It wheel. blows my mind that I was just here with Chloe in an alternate reality. And we can look. Those beached whales look so awful, but still so majestic. I can't believe nobody considered that they would smell in the game. How can all of this not be connected to a major storm? Okay, what's going on here? No swimming? Good thing there are no actual cops around to bust us. Due to recent coastal events, the Arcadia City Bay the Arcadia Bay City Council has closed the beaches to any wading, surfing, or swimming. This is for the safety of both the marine life and the public. Violators will be subject to a fine or and or imprisonment. Uh, there's nothing up here. Garbage. Take the trash out sometime, dude. Table. This is where Frank ponders his existence and gets drunk. Right. Dog bow. Oh, fresh meat. So Pompadou must be okay. Good doggy. And window. Can't see inside with this shit blocking the view. Hmm. Okay, let's see what happens. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? We just want to ask you some questions. You have some serious lady balls. No. Jesus, okay. Okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? Sure. Uh, good. You already did. 
You don't get it. Help or else. I'm sorry. Help or else. You don't get it. You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. No, man. I do not get it. Especially from a weirdo like you. You know, I hate the way you talk to me. Like you, like you know more than I do. No, no, I'm not. I, I do know I, more than you do. Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shit. You expect everything for free. You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. You snobby whores. Don't come into my home and judge me. That's why I go to church. And you want something from me? How about a blade up the ass, huh? Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch? Get it? Step the fuck back now! Nice. Nice. Smooth. Now shoot dog. him too. Oh my god! Nice. Good job. Nice. Look at that. Well done. He attacked you. You stood your ground. The American gun laws are on your side. We get oh rid no. of a drug dealer. Yes. Chloe. Yes. I just shot a man and his dog. Yes, you did. I killed Frank Bowers. Yes. You don't owe he him money. my life, Chloe. It, it was self-defense for both of us. Max? Frank is really dead. Yes. But we can't stop now. We have to find that code. Fast. Before the co cops come. Now, before I rewind time. Before I rewind time, we were never here, okay? Don't worry about it. Unless you really want him dead. Do we want him dead or do we don't want him dead? That's it. Let's get out of here. Sorry, Frank. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. He came at you with a knife. Don't be sorry. Jesus. Chloe actually killed Frank. She'll never forgive herself. Or forget this. And only I can change it. Um... I actually like how this turned out. I don't know. I don't know. The thing is, I... look. Chloe's gonna be messed up. See, that's the problem is that Chloe is clearly not the kind of cold-blooded murderer that I am because she's gonna be messed up emotionally and uh, that might be something that we regret I... I'd be okay I don't think Chloe will be okay No, Chloe's not okay <laughs> 